Good evening, everyone. Hello, friends. Welcome to the live channel of Creative Edge Top Rankers. Friends, my name is Rajendra Bhatia, and I am here to give you some very important terms of architecture which are asked during NATA. So my topic is important architectural terms for NATA 2023. I will be taking some of the important questions, idea as to what all to be studied as far as AAT is concerned, Architecture Awareness Test. Now, I have used the same term what IIT uses for their final examination uh, while giving entrance to the, the architecture students. There you know that the, the stream is like you have to uh, clear the J prelims and then advance and then AAT. However, this term suits best to the architecture awareness part of our syllabus. Like some of the sample question, identify the picture and select the two correct options. Sill plate, mud plate, ground gel, midnight sill. To such question, the answer will be A and D. What were A and D? Cell plate and midnight cell. So friends, note, cell plate or soul plate is in construction and architecture is the bottom horizontal member of a wall building to which the vertical members are attached. Other names are ground plate, ground cell, ground cell, and midnight cell. So now remember in architecture, um, particularly NATA, the most suitable answer has to be selected. Or in other words, you should go with the selection by rejection. I will be covering up a lot of things in coming up couple of days uh, for you all, like I will be live with you um, every day, Monday, Tuesday, Monday is today, Tuesday and Wednesday as well. So friends, uh, be attentive to my, uh, these uh, small presentation, which will give you some idea as to what is to be done in NATA examination. At the same time, I will request you to not to ignore my, um, upcoming course, which is which I'm going to announce right in the end of this presentation. What is a vault in architecture? Select the two correct option with re reference to it. A self-supporting arched or arch serving to cover a space with a ceiling or roof, usually made up of marble, generally circular in shape. A and B, that means a self-supporting arch or serving to cover a space with a ceiling or roof are the correct answer. Now, the notes for that, in architecture, a vault is a self-supporting arched form, usually of stone or brick serving to cover a space with a ceiling or roof. The simplest kind of vault is the barrel vault. Now here I have selected some of the um, typical vaults. There are many more also, but in Romanescu time, the barrel vault was one of the most common one and the simplest also. Also, it used to be called as a wagon or a tunnel vault which is generally semicircular in shape. The other vault that I have uh, given into picture are groin vault. Uh, that was a late Romanesque period. Then rib vault, like there is a rib here and on across it also. So the rib vault, late Romanesque and early Gothic period. 
and then the fan world which is like an ellipse around but uh, the the openings are like arranged in a fan shaped so that is fan world that was purely in the gothic time we come to the next question which are the following are types of inorganic building materials very simple kind of question and you have to select two of them and uh, well i think you know what is organic what is inorganic that simple question can get you two marks straight away so b and d out of uh, mud gypsum wood and cement right so gypsum is an inorganic substance and cement everybody knows is an inorganic material organic material are mud and wood so inorganic material the building materials processed by the addition of other elements are an organic material in organic material everybody knows from the chemi chemistry also these material perform better when processed example of these include consist of cement lime gypsum steel etc now here a course is a layer of same unit running horizontally in a wall select two types of courses string course belt course straight course foot course answer are a and b string course and belt course so here is an example of belt course and here is an example of string course today i am only focusing with some terminology or some terms architectural terms those are asked in the or which i expect them to be asked in the nata examination identify the arch in the illustration and you have to name it naturally now it cannot be named as two kind of arches it has to be one kind of arch so the answer will be only one out of the four option given equilateral arch lancet arch drop arch and tudor arch b is the answer the lancet arch the lancet arch is a variety of pointed arch in which each of the arcs or curves of the arch have a radius longer than the width of the arch it takes its name from being a shape like the tip of a lance reference image this is this is a lance lance in the that is the top of the arrow okay the lancet window is one of typical features of the early british 13th century period in gothic architecture what are the two correct stages of construction now back to the two questions pre construction interior planning framing exterior construction a and d are the correct answer a and d are pre construction and exterior construction now here i have tried explaining what are the six stages of construction um, generally accepted pre construction site work and foundation rough framing exterior construction mep that is mechanical electrical and plumbing then finishes and fixtures these are the standard of any construction six stages a businessman may say no 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 before all of this the funding has to be the first stage of construction now i'm just joking not in the architecture we are concerned with real construction so a wall may be defined as a component of a building whose width is at least that has should have been times its thickness 24860 it's only one answer to this and that is four explanation a wall is a vital component of building whose function is to 
divide the space of the building generally the width of the wall exceeds four times its thickness there are basically two types of walls load bearing and non load bearing walls so would you like to join for a course with creative edge look at the offerings on the next slide i am happy to announce a power pack data crash course crash course of 15 days the course include live classes recorded lectures mock tests with video analysis advanced counseling sessions e study material comprehensive coverage of course starting date is 22nd june price is just 2999 enroll now through the number 7676564400 and yes the same repetition price 2999 and roll now i will just look into some of the question if they are worth now hello sir is no question somebody asking third attempt going to be the tough the other one answering they both are same friends i will have a repeat uh, youtube live on uh, whether to take the third attempt or not incidentally the application time has been shifted to uh, 27th june earlier it was 24th announcement and uh, yes you can apply on up to 27th and the exam is of course on 9th of july whatever i am taking today as my life is all about the important architectural terms but these are not the all these are the sample ones similar things can be studied with us during upcoming uh, 15 days power packed nata crash course right friends so see you tomorrow as well and in the meantime if you haven't yet subscribe my channel don't fail to subscribe and uh, and of course you can ask questions as well on 7676564400 they get conveyed to me bye bye for now all the best